Dianogest, sold under the brand names Natasia and Q Lyra among others, is a progestin medication which is used in birth control pills and in the treatment of endometriosis. It is also used in menopausal hormone therapy and to treat heavy periods. Dianogest is available both alone and in combination with estrogens. It is taken by mouth. Side effects of Dianogest include menstrual irregularities, headaches, nausea, breast tenderness, depression, and acne, among others. Dianogest is a progestin, or a synthetic progestogen, and hence is an agonist of the progesterone receptor, the biological target of progestogens like progesterone. It is a unique progestogen, with strong effects in the uterus. The medication has some antiandrogenic activity, which may help to improve androgen dependent symptoms like acne, and has no other important hormonal activity. Dianogest was discovered in 1979 and was introduced for medical use in 1995. Additional formulations of Dianogest were approved between 2007 and 2010. It is sometimes referred to as a fourth generation progestin. Dianogest is marketed widely throughout the world. It is available as a generic medication. Medical uses Birth control Dianogest is used primarily in birth control pills in combination with ethanolestradiol under the brand name Valette. It is also available in a quadrophasic birth control pill combined with estradiol valerate, marketed as Natasia in the United States and Q Lyra in some European countries and Russia. Endometriosis Dianogest is approved as a standalone medication under the brand names Visan and Dynagist in various places such as Europe, Australia, Japan, Singapore, and Malaysia for the treatment of endometriosis. It has been found to be equally effective as gonadotropin-releasing hormone agonists, GnRH agonists, such as luprorilin, in the treatment of endometriosis. Heavy periods Birth control pills containing dianogest and estradiol valerate are approved in the United States for the treatment of menorrhagia, heavy menstrual bleeding. Menopausal symptoms Dianogest is used in combination with estradiol valerate in the treatment of menopausal symptoms in certain countries such as Germany and the Netherlands. Available forms Dianogest is available both alone and in combination with estrogens. The following formulations are available. Dianogest 1 mg oral tablets Dynagest, and 2 mg oral tablets Valette, indicated for endometriosis. Dianogest 2 mg and estradiol valerate 3 mg oral tablets Natasia, indicated for contraception and menorrhagia. Dianogest 2 to 3 mg and estradiol valerate 1 to 3 mg oral tablets Q Lyra, indicated for contraception Dianogest 2 mg and ethanolestradiol 30 micrograms oral tablets Valette, indicated for contraception Dianogest 2 mg and estradiol valerate 1 or 2 mg oral tablets various indicated for menopausal hormone therapy the availability of these formulations differs by country see availability contraindications Contraindications of Dianogest include active venous thromboembolism, previous or current cardiovascular disease, diabetes with cardiovascular complications, previous or current severe liver disease or tumors, hormone-dependent cancers such as breast cancer, and undiagnosed vaginal bleeding. Side effects Side effects associated with Dianogest are the same as those expected of a progestogen. They include menstrual irregularities, headaches, nausea, breast tenderness, depression, acne, weight gain, flatulence, and others. Dianogest produces no androgenic side effects and has little effect on metabolic and lipid hemostatic parameters. Overdose 
In safety studies, Dianogest has been assessed in women with endometriosis at high doses of as much as 20 mg per day for up to 24 weeks and produced no clinically relevant effects on lipid metabolism, liver enzymes, the coagulatory system, or thyroid metabolism. Interactions Dianogest is metabolized mainly by the cytochrome P450 enzyme CYP3A4, and for this reason, inhibitors and inducers of CYP3A4 can alter the amount of exposure to dianogest when administered concomitantly with it. For a list of CYP3A4 inhibitors and inducers, see here, the strong CYP3A4 inhibitors ketoconazole and erythromycin have been found to increase exposure to dianogest by up to three-fold, whereas the strong CYP3A4 inducer rifampicin, rifampin was found to decrease steady state and area under curve concentrations of dianogest by 50% and 80%, respectively. Pharmacology Pharmacodynamics Dianogest has progestogenic activity, possibly some antiprogestogenic activity, and has antiandrogenic activity. The medication does not interact with the estrogen receptor, the glucocorticoid receptor, or the mineralocorticoid receptor, and hence has no estrogenic, glucocorticoid, or antimineralocorticoid activity. Because of its relatively high selectivity as a progestogen, dianogest may have favorable safety and tolerability compared to various other progestins. Progestogenic activity Dianogest is an agonist of the progesterone receptor PR, and hence is a progestogen. It has relatively weak affinity for the PR in vitro in human uterine tissue, about 10% that of progesterone. Despite its low affinity for the PR however, dianogest is said to have high progestogenic activity in vivo. In addition, although its metabolites, such as 9-alpha, 10-beta-dihydrodinogest and 3-alpha, 5-alpha tetrahydrodinogest, have greater affinity for the PR than does dianogest itself, the medication is said not to be a prodrug. Dianogest is described as special. Progestogen, possessing low or moderate antigonadotropic efficacy but strong or very strong endometrial efficacy. Specifically in relation to endometrial activity, dianogest is said to be one of the strongest progestogens available. The high endometrial activity of dianogest underlies its ability to stabilize the menstrual cycle when combined with either ethanolestradiol or estradiol valerate in birth control pills, and also its use in the treatment of endometriosis. The combination of most other progestins with estradiol as birth control pills failed due to a high incidence of irregular menstrual bleeding. This is a property that ethanolestradiol does not share with estradiol, because of its resistance to metabolism in the endometrium and hence its greater relative effects in this part of the body. In contrast to other progestins, due to its high endometrial efficacy, the combination of dianogest with estradiol valerate in birth control pills is able to prevent breakthrough bleeding, and is uniquely able to treat heavy menstrual bleeding. The absence of withdrawal bleedings, otherwise known as silent menstruations, also may occur, unlike other progestogens, except in the case of its strong effects in the uterus, dianogest is said to lack antiestrogenic effects, and does not antagonize the beneficial effects of estradiol, for instance in the metabolic and vascular systems, dianogest also showed some possible antiprogestogenic activity in one animal bioassay when administered before but not at the same time as progesterone, the minimum effective dose of oral dianogest required to inhibit ovulation is 1 mg per day. The inhibition of ovulation by dianogest occurs mainly via a direct peripheral action in the ovary of inhibiting folliculogenesis as opposed to a central action of inhibiting gonadotropin secretion. Oral treatment of dianogest 2 mg per day in cyclical women reduced serum progesterone levels to anovulatory levels, but circulating levels of luteinizing hormone and follicle-stimulating hormone were not considerably affected. At this dosage, estradiol levels are reduced to early follicular phase levels of about 30 to 50 pg per milliliter. Such levels are insufficient for reactivation of endometrioses, but are sufficient to prevent menopausal-type symptoms such as hot flashes and bone loss. 
This is in contrast to gonadotropin releasing hormone analogs, GnRH analogs. Dianogest appears to have similar effects in the breasts as norethisterone acetate, and may likewise increase the risk of breast cancer when combined with an estrogen in postmenopausal women, although this has yet to be confirmed with clinical research. Antigonadotropic effects Dianogest has been found to suppress testosterone levels in men by 43% at 2 mg per day, 70% at 5 mg per day, and 81% at 10 mg per day. In general, progestogens are able to suppress testosterone levels in men by a maximum of about 70-80% to at sufficiently high dosages. Antiandrogenic activity Dianogest is said to be one of the only 19 nortestosterone derivative progestins that does not have androgenic properties. In fact, it is actually an antagonist of the androgen receptor, R, and hence has antiandrogenic activity. The antiandrogenic activity of dianogest in the Hirschberger test is about 30 to 40 percent of that of saproterin acetate. It may be able to improve androgen-dependent symptoms such as acne and hirsutism. Metabolites of dianogest, such as 9-alpha, 10-beta-dihydrodinogest and 3-alpha, 5-alpha-tetrahydrodinogest, show greater affinity for the R than does dianogest itself. Dianogest has no affinity for sex hormone binding globulin SHBG, and hence does not displace testosterone or estradiol from this plasma protein or increase the free fractions of these hormones. Other activities Dianogest does not inhibit or induce CYP3A4, unlike many other related progestins. Because of this, dianogest may have a lower propensity for drug interactions. Pharmacokinetics Dianogest is rapidly absorbed with oral administration and has high bioavailability of approximately 90%. Peak levels of dianogest occur within approximately two hours after an oral dose. The pharmacokinetics of dianogest are linear. Single oral doses of dianogest were found to result in maximal levels of 28 nanograms per milliliter with 1 milligram, 54 nanograms per milliliter with 2 milligrams, 101 nanograms per milliliter with 4 milligrams, and 212 nanograms per milliliter with 8 milligrams. The corresponding area under the curve levels were 306, 577, 1153, and 2,293 nanograms per milliliter, respectively. Dianogest reaches steady state concentrations within six days of continuous administration, and does not accumulate in the body. The plasma protein binding of dianogest is 90%, with a relatively high free fraction of 10%. It is exclusively bound to albumin, with no binding to SHBG or corticosteroid binding globulin. The lack of affinity of dianogest for SHBG is in contrast to most other 19 nortestosterone progestins. The volume of distribution of dianogest is relatively low at 40 L. Dianogest is metabolized in the liver. Metabolic pathways of dianogest include reduction of its delta-4-3 keto group, hydroxylation mainly via CYP3A4, removal of its C17-alpha cyanomethyl group, and conjugation. The metabolites of dianogest are quickly excreted and are said to be mostly inactive. The elimination half-life of dianogest is relatively short at approximately 7.5 to 10.7 hours. The short half-life of dianogest relative to other 19 nortestosterone progestins is in part due to its lack of binding to SHBG and hence prolongation in the circulation. The clearance of dianogest is 3L-H. It is eliminated mainly in the urine, both as sulfate and glucuronide conjugates and as free steroid. Chemistry Dianogest, also known as delta 9 to 17 alpha CYANOMETHYL 19 nortestosterone or as 17 alpha CYANOMETHYL ESTRA 4, 19 17 beta OL 31, is a synthetic estrained steroid and a derivative of testosterone. It is a member of the estrained subgroup of the 19 nortestosterone family of progestins, but unlike most other 19 nortestosterone progestins, is not a derivative of norethisterone, 17 alpha ethynyl 19 nortestosterone. This is because it uniquely possesses a cyanomethyl group at the C17 alpha position rather than the usual ethynyl group. 
It is also unique among most 19 nortestosterone progestins in that it has a double bond between the C9 and C10 positions. Dianogest is the C17 alpha cyanomethyl derivative of the anabolic androgenic steroid AAS dienolone, as well as the C17 alpha cyanomethyl analog of the AAS methyl dienolone, 17 alpha methyl dienolone, and ethyl dienolone, 17 alpha ethyl dienolone. In terms of structure activity relationships, the C17 alpha cyanomethyl group of Dianogest is responsible for its unique antiandrogenic instead of androgenic activity relative to other 19 nortestosterone progestins. A loss of ability to activate the R is also seen with other testosterone derivatives with extended length C17 alpha substitutions such as Topter 1 propyl testosterone compared to the AAS ethyl testosterone and methyl testosterone and allylestronol compared to the AAS ethylestronol. Studies with steroids similar to Dianogest e.g., Dienolone, have found that the introduction of a double bond between the C9 and C10 positions is associated with similar, almost unchanged affinity for the PR and R. On the other hand, the C9-10 double bond of Dianogest appears to inhibit metabolism via 5-alpha reductase and or 5-beta reductase, which is the major metabolic route for other 19 nortestosterone progestins like norethisterone, norgestrel, and etinogestrel, and this may serve to improve the metabolic stability and potency of Dianogest. History Dianogest was synthesized in 1979 in Jena, Germany under the leadership of Kurt Ponsold, was initially referred to as STS-557. It was found that its potency was 10 times that of levonorgestrel. The first product on the market to contain Dianogest was a combined birth control pill, with ethanolistradiol, Valet, introduced in 1995 and made by Genifarm. In 2007, Dianogest was introduced as Dynagest in Japan for the treatment of endometriosis, and it was subsequently marketed for this indication as Basan in Europe and Australia in December 2009 and April 2010, respectively. Q Lyra was introduced in Europe in 2009 and Natasia was introduced in the United States in 2010. Society and culture Generic names Dianogest is the generic name of the drug and it's in, USAN, BAN, and JAN, while Dianogest is its DCF. It is also known by its synonyms Dinogestrel and Cyanomethyldienolone as well as by its numerous former developmental code names including BAE 86 5258, M18575, MJR35, Shish 660, Shish T00660 AA, STS 557, and ZK37659. Brand names Dianogest is marketed in combination with estradiol valerate as a birth control pill primarily under the brand names Natasia and Q-Lyra and in combination with ethanolistradiol as a birth control pill primarily under the brand name Valet, although these combinations are marketed under numerous other brand names as well. In the case of the Dianogest and estradiol valerate birth control pill, these other brand names include Jonda and Clara. Dianogest is also marketed in combination with estradiol valerate for use in menopausal hormone therapy under a variety of brand names including Climodian, Climodine, Estradiol Valerot Dianogest, Climodian, Lafami, Lafleur, Mevrin, Valerix, and Belvian. Dianogest is marketed as a standalone medication for the treatment of endometriosis primarily under the brand name Visan, but is also available under the brand names Alondra, Dynagist, Disvin, Visabel, and Visanet in various countries. Availability Dianogest is available both alone and in combination with ethanolistradiol and estradiol valerate widely throughout the world, including but not limited to Canada, Europe, Latin America, and Southeast Asia. It is available specifically as a standalone medication in Canada, Europe, Latin America, Russia, Australia, South Africa, Georgia, Israel, Japan, South Korea, Hong Kong, and Thailand. It is notably not available as a standalone medication in the United States or the United Kingdom. Research As of July 2018, Dianogest is in Phase 3 clinical trials in Japan for the treatment of adenomyosis and dysmenorrhea. 
The combination of estradiol valerate and dianogest is in pre-registration in Europe for the treatment of acne. Dianogest is also being evaluated for the potential treatment of anorexia nervosa. References Further reading External links Dianogest, Addison site